Researchers in Iowa City at the University of Iowa are improving their smart sensor designed specifically to help farmers. Yeah, we told you about this product back in May, and today KWW reporter Taylor Vessel checked in on the team's progress. He's live right now in the studio. One of the biggest allies and foes for a farmer is Mother Nature. While she's a rather imposing force, these sensors hope to level the playing field. We're looking for atmospheric uh, temperature, pressure, and humidity. Gathering a myriad of weather data, this sensor aims to show the discrepancies between weather predicted and what actually happens, giving farmers a better sense of when to irrigate. We are able to now deploy about uh, 30 sensors across the Midwest. University of Iowa professor June Wang leads the team. Now that the sensors are in the fields, Wang hopes for a product review from their ideal customers, the farmers themselves. And that input is very critical for us to to plan how we should design the center, how we should deliver information. It can sense uh, soil moisture or any variable around there, and in real time we can capture this data. Lorena Castro-Garcia demonstrates how sensitive the device is, raising it above her head and the pressure drops, something they hope also happens with a different aspect. It's all about price. Spencer Cool, who helped develop the prototype, says a similar product on the market costs thousands of dollars for just one. The design idea for these sensors is to drive the price way down and to have hundreds of sensors in a field rather than one sensor in a field. More sensors means more data, which means a better understanding. And you can gather these up and get an idea for how the farm is actually uh, behaving. Now, the design of the sensor also allows for future development, like a CO2 sensor. Right now, though, the team is working on adding a component to go into the ground that will measure the soil's moisture. Taylor Vessel, New 7K, WWL. Hey Taylor, really fascinating. By the way, farmers, if you're interested in a sensor, researchers say just reach out to them. And we have the contact information in this story on our website, kwwl.com. And a big reminder tonight, coming up next Wednesday, November 20th, right here live, KWWL News will feature a special report which does focus for an entire hour on Iowa farming. Catch Growing Forward, the future of farming right here Wednesday night live at 6 o'clock.